Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Mad as a Goat. Now I just was, I just saw this recently, apparently there's this video going around and it's this young Korean girl being harassed by three dudes in a bar or some sort of scene of that nature, right? So it's a public place. This poor lady's, they, if you go watch the video, alright? Ray William Johnson's already done a video on it, you'll see it on the featured fucking part on YouTube. You can go and see this video and it's fucking horrible. Yes, some people who think sexism is hilarious to the point of totally degrading a woman in public may find it funny, but in my opinion, they're absolute cunts. I honestly watched that and I just felt sorry for the girl. And I want to start a new trend for the ladies, right? Instead of putting up with that sort of bullshit, I reckon every woman should have a taser. Because that kind of shit isn't that uncommon. Okay? It happens every Friday and Saturday night all around the world in nightclubs everywhere. Women getting treated like absolute fucking slaves. And yes, you may think I sound like a sympathetic pussy, and maybe I do, but I don't give a fuck, man. I honestly think women should be allowed to carry tasers. Because, think about that. That lady's in a public place. I assume that place has security. I assume that place has cameras. I assume that place has people walking around who witnessed what was going on, but didn't have the balls to kick their fucking asses. Now, me personally, I... <coughs> I don't go out to bars or nightclubs for this exact reason because I'm a fucking nut, all right? I reckon everyone has the right to enjoy themselves and if they're getting some if they get three dudes on one chick, man, that's just wrong in any context. I don't even think, you know, three dudes and a girl, let's get some hanky-panky going. Just admit you're gay and go to prison. I mean, Seriously, this sort of shit pisses me off, and I can't go to these places because I'd glass people, get a few drinks in me, and I think I'm a total fucking rock star, man. I'll think I'm the biggest and hardest Hulk Hogan motherfucker in the world. I'm the kind of cunt who'd see that guy and be like, you're a fucking dead right? and I'd end up stabbing someone in the face, mostly because our society is full of a bunch of pussies. Like I said, that was a crowded place. You can hear the crowd in the background, all right? There's security there. No one stepped in. This video goes for at least, like, you know, a minute, so this was going on for, I assume, at least five minutes. This lady had to put up with this shit. And no one stepped in. Not one person. Do you see at any point in the video someone stepping in and pushing these little guys away and starting a fight? No, you don't see shit. And that fucking, that's just disgraceful to me. The fact that this woman had to put up with this bullshit for more than five seconds. And the fact that she's, it's illegal for women to carry tasers. You know what, fuck them. Fuck the law. Carry your tasers. Carry your pepper spray. They, no one should have to put up with that kind of bullshit. And these motherfuckers, they're thinking they're so great because they can degrade her and put her down. Oh, your, your teeth look horrible. They look all gross and shit like that. Um, she's already better than you just by the content of the video. You're three dudes ganging up on one woman. And this ain't a muscle-bound woman with, like, shoulder muscles up to here. They're, they're not hard men. These guys are fucking pussies. And I wish, I wish that more of our society had the same opinion as me. You see a pussy acting like a pussy, you beat the living shit through them. And the reason why men get away with this sort of shit all the time, why you, we've all witnessed it. We've all been going through a shopping mall. We've all, you know, gone out sometime and seen some lady being de totally degraded by some fucking cunt. But if you step in and you stab the guy, you're going to jail. Oh, that's fucking bullshit. I reckon we should be able to beat the living cunt out of these people. Fucking pussies. Absolute fucking cowards. I mean, it, oh, I watched that video and I almost punched the screen on my computer. Not because of the actual content, but just because of the fact that the people surrounding this poor lady were fucking pussies. You fucking cowards. You go around on your high horse thinking you're great because you have a great social life on Friday night. I bet you see that shit all the time and you walk straight past it. Three dudes. Three fucking bogans, okay? I could have kicked their asses easy, easily. Give me a trolley pole and I'll fucking crack all their fucking skulls. But everyone else is a fucking liberal pussy. Uh, it's wrong to be violent. In some cases, okay, I agree, violence doesn't work. But when you got these kind of cunts around, these kind of cunts need their heads belted the fuck in. And I'm not talking about just a little black eye or anything. I'm talking about cracking skulls. I'm talking about, like, grabbing their head, putting on the ground, and laying your knee into it. I can't go anywhere. Let's face it, I'm a fucking angry motherfucker. If I go out and see this short sort of shit, there won't be any more mad as a goat. I'll be going directly to jail after I stab someone in the face with a broken fucking beer bottle because the rest of society are a bunch of fucking cowards and you see this shit all the time you know I'm not gonna say that I don't degrade women on some level I will admit if I see a woman in public dressed in a certain way I'm not looking at her going oh she looks nice I am looking at her and going god damn I will admit I do degrade women on a certain level but when you got three dudes like putting their fingers in her mouth and totally harassing a lady and no one does a fucking thing fuck 
Jesus! And people wonder why I hate society. Everyone's a fucking coward. Go back to the 60s. Try that shit then. Try that shit then in a public place. You would have had some fucking stocky fucking bikey come up and go, fuck off, mate. I'll fucking rip your eyelids off and fucking skull fuck you, alright? Fuck off. That's what it used to be like back in the day. But our cool hipster generation are a bunch of goddamn cowards. Lady had to put up with this for ages. And that's why I don't like places like Japan, where, the, you know, women are treated like fucking slaves. You know, some people say, oh, it's part of the culture, you know, they haven't evolved. Yeah, I'll go over there and go crack some fucking skulls, mate. That'll evolve them pretty fucking quickly. People thinking they can just treat other people like shit. We look at most of the content on this channel. Most of the stuff I get pissed off about is people either being segregated because they're not hipsters or trendies, or people being attacked with knives, or people being pushed aside because they don't follow everyone else. I hate this sort of behaviour and the only reason it exists is because everyone's a goddamn coward. Fucking hell. I don't give a shit what kind of heat I get from saying this shit in these videos. That fucking pissed me off, man. It pissed me off. Fucking immensely. It's fucking 2013 and people are still treating women like they were getting treated back in 1950. We haven't evolved at all. Our society isn't moving along. We're not moving forward. We're going fucking backwards. We're going in the opposite direction of progress. And there's only one solution. If everyone else ain't gonna do shit, do something yourself. You ever see that shit? Don't fucking walk past it. Don't walk past it. Because let's face it, if a man is, you know, three dudes on one small woman, they're a bunch of pussies. And I'm a man who likes to make myself feel big. I see three pussies, I'm going to kick their fucking asses just to make myself feel big. Yeah, that's my style. Fucking disgraceful. Fucking pissed me off. And you see this shit all the time, like the woman who's with the boyfriend who's slapping her around and everyone's walking by. Yeah, I know why people do that. I have been bashed for stepping in. But I still had the balls to step in, and I will keep stepping in. I don't give a fuck, because these pussies got to be put in their place. Let's face it, the law ain't going to do fucking shit about it. It's fucking disgraceful. Pisses me the hell off. Jesus Christ, motherfucking coward motherfuckers. You want to be a sexist prick and totally debauch women in public? Just wait, mate. Just wait. Try that shit around a psycho like me. And yeah, I am a fucking psycho. And I'm not the only one out there. There's other people. There's people who are just getting into the nightclubs now who are just like me, who are total fucking nutbags. I hope you fucking find your comeuppance at the end of a fucking fist, you motherfuckers. Jesus Christ. Oh, yeah, I'm all for a sexist joke and everything, but treating someone like that? You fucking cunt. I don't care, people said, oh, it's from a movie, oh, it was set up, it was fake. It's not entertaining, it's not funny, it gets, it makes my fucking blood boil. I had steam coming out of my veins, man. Fucking horrible, our society is going down the toilet. Our music's going down the toilet, our movies are, the storylines to our movies are shit, and just common behaviour and common decency is going down the toilet with it. I can't believe what's happening in our society, and everyone just acts like a fucking pussy and does nothing about it. Jesus Christ, fuck society. I don't want to be social, I don't want to go out and socialise with you pussy motherfuckers. I'd rather sit inside all day than go out there and see that shit. Bad enough I saw it illuminate off my fucking screen. If I saw that shit in public, like I said, I'm a fucking goner, I'm going to prison, I'm taking a shiv up the ass within the hour because I can't handle that shit. Okay, I've been treated like shit, I've been treated like a piece of crap, maybe not in the same context, luckily I'm not attractive, and I hate that excuse, oh she's attractive and she dresses a certain way, fuck you, she can dress any way she likes, as long as she hasn't got her vagina exposed, there's no problem, don't use that as an excuse for your pussy ass behaviour you fucking cunts. Fuck him. Kill him. Stab him in the fucking face. No wonder someone called up anonymous, anonymously. If you're linked to that shit, I'll fucking skull fuck you to death. Fucking cunt. Anyway, that's the one of the angriest episodes of Matters Ago. I'll see you fucking pussy bitches on the other side.